I don't know, I suppose it backfired. I started an image on purpose six or seven years ago, and uh, it just backfired on me. What did you see as that image? Well, I used to do things for publicity, hoping that I'd get my name in the papers and people would take notice of me. And then I ended up and I didn't want to see my name in the papers, but it uh, couldn't be helped. Do you feel very bitter about it all now? Uh, not bitter. I'm, uh, I suppose I feel sorry for myself. But, uh, I'm not bitter against anyone or anything. It's just the way it's gone. What sort of pressures do you feel that you've been under? Uh, I don't know, a lot of different reasons. I just, I feel now that I, I can't play as I, I could before. So uh, I don't want to play uh, a lower standard than I'm used to myself. And uh, I don't think I can play to a high standard, so I've decided to quit. Why not? Why can't you play at a high standard anymore? Uh, I don't know, because I'm not physically fit and I don't think I'm mentally fit to play football. So I've decided to call it a day. What, what's caused it, basically? Strains, pressures, tensions? I suppose so. Over this last few years, uh, they've got worse. And uh, just, I don't know, maybe I just can't take it, the, the pressures. Uh, well, I, I can't take it, so I've just decided to quit. At the moment, how would you describe your, your mental state? Uh, at the moment, I think I'm a complete wreck you know, in every way, which is uh, why I came here. I didn't decide to come here, I just went to the airport and ended up here. I just wanted to get away from it. What, on the verge of a nervous breakdown? Uh, probably, yeah. I think uh, if I hadn't got away, I would have had one. And here I'm hoping I might not stay here. Now, when the, all this blows over, I'll, I'll probably disappear somewhere else.